happy Friday roomies I hope you're getting a little bit of me time if possible so you know if I'm in my closet it's a closet confessional and today's episode is the royal edition look get in your closet play dress up I say this all the time when are you ever going to be able to do it you got to hide from the real world sometimes like kids do it's okay all right so what I did here was um put on some of my costume jewelry uh found this really cute houndstooth jacket i forgot i had a uh, brooch houndstooth uh, print glasses my wedding tiara you know gets it in went to the liquor store got me an eight dollar bottle of wine you put that bitch in a champagne flute and i promise you you're gonna feel fancy don't matter what it costs don't matter what it costs i promise you so with this episode being the royal edition, I thought that I would hit you guys with some uh, royal etiquette. Some things maybe you didn't know that goes on in the monarchy, okay? So let me hit you. When the queen is done eating, everyone is done eating. You know what she does? She puts her handbag on the plate. That says to me, okay, not only is the party over, but doggy bags up. Yup, that's telling me. Queen say, yo, bags on the table, fill that shit up and be out, bounce. I like her style, okay? Um, the Duchess slant. Now that's the way that these royals cross their legs not to show anything, okay? So what they do is they put their knees and their legs together and they cross their ankles. They do this so that their hoo-ha is not saying hello, okay? And I, I promise you, you hardly never see a, a, a panty line on a royal. So I think they go commando and I think that's why the rule is so uh, strictly enforced, okay? I think that's pretty much it now um here what else we got okay the royals keep their curtsies light and and subtle they don't go real deep with it you know why that's because you curtsy the damn queen every time you see her like damn uh, uh queen we just saw you at breakfast we're curtsying again all right we're having high tea curtsy again so long deep uh curtsies are not necessary for the royal family that's more if you're meeting the queen for the first time plus two you gotta curtsy all the time you're gonna bust your ass eventually and i promise you that is not gonna be a pretty sight especially if you're going commando uh you're not allowed to show cleavage <sighs> i'm out they do this now there's a good reason why they do this okay you know how the, uh, the royals wave like this they don't want your nipples doing that they don't want your nips waving in in, in the breeze okay now that's smart all right you know a little modesty okay um when entering a room it goes by rank the queen is always first of course the best part is the queen runs the damn show her mans even has to walk steps behind her long live the queen she knows what she's doing okay um also too the queen loves corgis if you don't know what a corgi is it's the royal dogs okay these dogs have it made they can run rampant through the palace do whatever they want to do shit piss everything you're not allowed to reprimand them you're not allowed to say a damn thing to these animals ain't that some shit let me come back as a as a, one of the queen's corgis in the next life i'll be living large they get gourmet meals don't sound bad to me don't sound bad to me so i love you guys get in your closet mess around have a good time be goofy have a freaking tea party tomorrow and as always get your me time chip chip cheerio and all that happy shit i love you till the next time